This was the first move I learned on NBA 2K25. As somebody that like L2 canceled the whole year last year, I said to myself, there's no way I'm going to go a day without learning this move. Clearly, it is a fun move to do. And it is in the game. Now, some of you guys were paying attention and you saw that I was doing the move in the first video that I dropped, literally. And the second video, and you were like, how are you already doing this? Well, I saved the video for a day that I know you guys would be able to play it, Friday, all right? I saved the video for Friday because guess what? You come home from school, you come home from work, you have the weekends, most people, right? And you get to enjoy the game and learn some moves. I'm going to teach you how to L2 cancel today. All I ask is hit that like button. Yeah, my Gaming is finally about to be able to enjoy the game now. It's my last dribble tutorial for now. It's time to play the game and have fun and shake some boy up. And maybe we get dropped off here and there, but we're going to shake some boy up, see him again. All right, so the hand cam is on the screen. So yeah, I already dropped tutorials on most of the moves that I do. You want to know the L2 cancel, and I already showed you guys a snippet of how it looks this year, but this year is a trick to it. It's all about the timing this year. You're going to have to get the timing, but I found a way that's <laughs> really good, and you're going to need Curry Escape for this. It has to have a good between the legs, all right? Watch this. Boom. This is the most consistent way that I know you can get it every time. Every time you want it, if you do that between the legs. Now, I will go try to find a between the leg that um escape, escape that has a good between the leg that's faster. I just really haven't had the time, guys. I've been trying to get so much videos out for you guys. That's why I just ask you to hit that like button because I've been I haven't been I haven't played one online game yet, guys. Literally. My build is only 88 overall because I've been trying to get content out for you guys. All right. So hit that like button for me, please. When you try to do it with the crab, the only way I've figured out how to do it is to do a size up first, then go back. But it's all about timing with it. Boom. 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 You see, it's, it's about timing. And then I'm going to slow it down and describe it to you guys because trying to do it right now and like you're probably not going to understand it because it was harder uh it was hard last year and this year it's even harder okay so a lot of you guys didn't get it down last year so i think the slow mo is just, is what's going to help and you're going to have to just do this one which to be honest it's just as effective if not more um i feel like this one is going to be better because it helps you keep the um defender <coughs> away boom the first one i'm going to explain to you guys is the easiest one all right this one is like L2 cancer from last year. You can do a size up, you run, you're going to try to run. All right, stay with me. All right, stay with me. Blows on skirt. All right. Cause last year it did difficult in a brother. So this year, I'm gonna try to figure out who I gonna learn the L2 cancel this year if it's harder this year. You understand? Let me see if you can do it without L2 canceling. No. Oh. inconsistent without it so l2 cancel yeah is i would start off by doing a size up and run right just do a size up and run size up run size up run right size up run so literally the first thing you're going to do is just do a size up into a speed boost just focus on doing this i'm gonna break it up into sections for you guys this time I'm doing a different approach when I'm teaching you, all right? Let me know if this one actually works better, all right? First step is just do a size up and run. If you don't know what to do this, watch my last video. And now when you do a size up and run, look for that first bounce right there. Boom. Boom. You see that? So when you, when you do a size up and you look for that first bounce, really the second bounce. Boom. Two. Okay. One, two, one, two. So when you do a move, a size up, that's the first bounce. When you run and you bounce to the basketball the second time, that's when you're looking for the cue. So the size up is the first bounce technically. So you're looking for the second bounce. That's the first bounce and boom, that's the second bounce when you hear the boom, all right? Once again, section two, first bounce, bullet. That's the second bounce. All right, maybe bullet sound better than you can remember it, right? Shout out Bullet TV. <laughs> but bullet, 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 bullet right there, all right? That's where you want to focus for the visual cue because that's going to be the most important part about doing a L2 cancel. 
because that is actually when you're going to start triggering your next move, which is the crab or the twin crab is when you see the bullet bounce right there, right? You're already going to start doing the move while holding L2. All right. I'm not going to jump ahead of you guys, but look, that's the, that's the first bounce. This is the second bounce. Boom. And then you start doing the crab back the other way, right? But just focus on the second bounce. That's your visual cue bullet right there. All right. That's when you're holding L2 right there. All right. This year, it's not going to stop you like last year. Second bounce. Boom. Right there. All right. Now you have the muscle memory. First bounce. Second bounce. Right. Once you fit, once you finish the first bounce, hold L2. When you start seeing the player moves. All right. Sprint. Hold L2. Once you start sprinting, hold L2. All right. Second most important thing. Once you finish the first bounce, this right here, and you start speed boosting, hold L2 the entire time. Do not let it go. Do not let go of L2 until you see the second bounce. But don't let go of it once you see the second bounce. Once you see the second bounce and you already start crabbing is when you let go of L2. But that is further on in the video. Right now, I'm just teaching you. Start holding L2 when you see the first bounce and don't let go of it yet. Keep holding L2. Even when you see the visual cue, keep holding L2. You understand me? All right, then. And then once you see the, the player has completed second bounce, like the basketball has touched the floor, you want to do a move back to cancel that direction, which is why this is going to be clutch. All right, the tween crab. Just do the tween crab or do a crab. If you do a crab diagonally down, it seems to me like it gives you more. Nah, the crab sometimes will give you that. So I think the better option is the twin crab. Just for now, until we get the muscle memory down. Boom. 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 So maybe after the twin crab, you can do um the, the crab. Nah, we'll figure it out. It's all about time. You can't really do it too fast. And I think that's my problem. I'm missing the window for it. So let's see if we can figure it out together before I really teach you. Boom. 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 Oh, boy. Boom. Yeah. Boom. I just told you we're going to figure it out and we figured it out right there. Now we have the blueprint because we did it with the hand cam. Now we can all learn it to freaking. <laughs> we can learn it together now, brothers. <laughs> we just did it right now. Hit that like button. Hit, hit the like button. Come on. Now, all together, this is the all together sauce. Do the speed boost like I told you. Hold L2 when your player starts running. And then you look for this bounce right here. Once you see this bounce right here, you are already going to start while holding L2 doing the crab back. All right. Once you start seeing the animation of the crab play out, you let go of L2. All right. Now, immediately when you start seeing the crab is when you let go of L2. Do not wait until it's fully played out. And right here, what you're seeing is me spamming the crab now that I already got the animation started. Because once you already got the size up boost into the crab started, you can crab back and forth now. All right, which is what I'm showing you. All I'm doing is the same mechanics right here. I actually messed up on it. I didn't do it on time. And you seen it was just a regular crab speed boost. But right here, I got it back and it looks snappier, right? So if you want to mute me, mute me and watch this section again. But I'm also going to run it back and explain it to you one more time. Everything that you just saw so you don't have to rewind it. Because Yaman Gaming is already thinking ahead of time. All right, brother, just cool. Do the speed boost. Run. When your player starts moving, hold L2 the entire time. Look for the visual cue right here. This is when you're going to start doing a crab back the other way. Once the crab animation starts, you want to let go of L2 and run the opposite direction that you're crabbing to, right? Boom, right here. And once you get that started, now you can do the crab L2 back and forth, all right? Which is what you're about to see. It's very easy, guys. And then I'll show you guys the tween version of it, which is way more consistent. See, once I already got the animation started, now I can actually do the crab back and forth like last year. But you have to do a move to get it started in the first place. As you can clearly see, I'm cutting it back left and right. And it's a very, very nice move already. And I've seen some people already doing it. But guess what? Yaman Gaming, he was in the lab the first day doing this. And I got the videos to show you already. Just check out my first two videos. I was already, already doing these in the videos that I was showing you. But I just didn't show you guys or talk about it yet. Because obviously I wanted to save the video for Friday. I mean, if I want no boy, I could it.
You see me? Call me know some crooks there out there. I'm joking. Anyways, <laughs> that was the crab version. Let's show you guys. Like I said, to do a crab, all you're doing is R2 flicking the right stick straight across the opposite ball hand. To do a, a tween crab R2 and flick the right stick diagonally down to the opposite ball hand and you get a, a tween crab. And that's essential because that's going to be the more consistent one. Once you cancel the animation, you're running. All right. Once you do a crab, you're going to run. All right. Same thing with the tween. You're going to run. Right. So boom, run diagonally up on the left stick to the opposite ball hand. You see what I'm saying? Bounce. Hold, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. First bounce. You're going to do the first bounce. Sprint. Hold L2. Look for the second bounce. And then do a, 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 a tween crab back the other way. And this one is the most consistent one that you can get every time. So I just showed you how to do a tween crab, right? Essentially, all you're doing right now is the same thing I just taught you. But instead of doing a crab by R2 flicking straight across to the opposite ball hand on the right stick, you're going to flick a little bit more diagonally down on the right stick to the opposite ball hand. All right, not straight across. And it is the same Thing, the same logic as before this one is going to be the more consistent one now this one is going to be determined by your escape package some some escape packages might have a different between the legs than curry i know damien Lillard has a similar one to curry but whatever escape you're using you let me know if it feels different with a different escape all right maybe there's a snappier one out there i, don't, I just didn't have the time to find it right now i'm trying to get these videos out to you fast so i can now get my player to above a 90 overall and actually play the game and get you guys some good content but if you're still watching this video this is going to be the most consistent one and i waited till the end to show you because it is going to be lethal trust me i can't wait to go to the streets them and put this to use Man, this is a good 2K already. I'm happy with what we're seeing, and now it's time to go have fun for me. Hit that like button. Let's do this. And you can just set up a fade. See that? But let's look again. Look for the first bounce. Crab. All right? Let me show you. Crab, size up, crab. Look for the first bounce, and then you would do a move right there. All right? So let me show you again. Size up. Look for the first bounce. And that's how it looks when you don't get the timing right. See why it's more inconsistent. Now watch me on the first time with the between the leg one opposite ball hand. See what I'm, you see what I'm saying? That's how they kind of tried to patch it this year that we can get it, but it's just more inconsistent to go left and right with, and I'm not saying just spam this, all right? Just don't spam this this year. You can do moves and get right. You see what I'm saying? There's a lot of things you can do. Like there's a lot of things you can do. Don't just be out here one dimensional doing some frigory.